guys. Hope you're doing well. Hope everything's going great for you and your family today. But I follow Grant Cardone. Okay, and he's doing a documentary on money. And what <coughs> were we taught as children, as teenagers, as adults, about money, right? And it's sad, <laughs> you know, because even, you know, for me, what my dad taught me about money was just to save. Uh, he told me to save for a rainy day. He told me to save for emergencies. Um, and he told me, don't be stupid with money, right? Now, most of us probably heard that, right? And that's it, right? We didn't hear nothing else, right? Some people heard money is the root of all evil. Rich people uh, are evil. Um, money doesn't grow on trees and money doesn't make you happy, right? So we all probably heard that. But the problem is, guys, we never learned how to get money, keep it, and multiply it. Right, because our parents didn't know. So my dad just said save it. That's all he knew about money was to save it, right? Go to work for it and then save it. That's all he knew. So that's all he can teach me and my brother, right? My mom never said nothing to me really about money. My grandmother never said nothing to me about money. My aunt never said nothing to me about money. My uncle, uh, <laughs> he used to give me money, but never said nothing about uh money to me guys and then I had you know various friends and stuff and adult friends they never said nothing to me about money and money is a scared subject to talk about people don't even want to stop and say you know how much money do you have in the bank right that's even scary for people to think about money is a very touchy subject okay when you're broke okay when you're broke money is a touchy subject right but now guys I've grown in my business, I've been able to make money. You know, I've been able to uh, teach other people about money as well. Okay. And like I said, with Grant Cardone, he's doing a whole documentary. Guys, make sure you go follow him. He's doing a whole documentary on why are people broke and what were people learned of when they were a kid and how he's going to change their belief. So here's, here's my takeaway from what I'm following from him, right? Money comes from people, guys, right? The more people that you help, here's, here's what you need to write down. And this is what you need to tell your children. Money comes from people. The more people you help, the more money you will make. Now, this is in your business, right? A job only caps your income, okay? A job caps, meaning caps your income. All right. A business unlocks unlimited potential for your income. Okay. Money is an energy. All right. Money only flows to people that know how to get it, keep it, and multiply it. Okay. Money is not evil, okay? Money does make you happy. How much people don't have money and they stressed? Money does make you happy. <laughs> I'm happy. I got some money. When I had no money, I was, I, was, I was depressed, okay? Money is to be made, invested, and multiplied. How do you get a lot of money? You service a lot of people, or you invest in different avenues. Stocks and bonds, real estate, investing in books, investing in seminars, investing in yourself so your mind can grow, so you can get more ideas about money, okay? It's not rocket science, guys. The reason people were broke is because they got the wrong information about money. People think that they have to work for money, right? But guys, once you understand that money comes from people, sky becomes the limit. Once you understand that money is an energy, guys, you will change your energy, okay? What if, what if you learned when you were a kid that money is an energy and you have to have good energy all the time? Would you maintain good energy, okay? The more people you help, 
the more money you make in a business. Profits are better than wages, okay? Profits is unlimited. Wages is limited, okay? Money must be multiplied and invested, right? So if you want to have a lot of money, guys, a job is not where you want to be at, okay? Creating and starting your own business is where you want to be at. That's why you find a mentor or you find a business to join and invest the time, invest the money to learn what they know. That's why I talk about network marketing and being a part of a network marketing company where people that know how to get money, keep money, multiply it, okay? They're in these companies and now you can get connected to these people and learn from these people, okay? The problem is people live check to check and they're not willing to sacrifice $500, uh, you know, in their car note or they rent this month. So next year they continue to live in poverty. The next following year they continue to live poor. The next following year they continue to be aggravated about money. Okay. Or get you a business coach or a business mentor or a life coach. Someone that's going to sit down with you and help you to plan out how are you going to make sales and how are you going to help a lot of people so you can make a lot of money, right? So thank God that my belief has changed, right? I do a lot of videos in my car, guys, why? Because I'm always on the move, going to the gym, going shopping, picking my kids up, going to see clients, going to pick up, uh, you know, clients going to drop off product to my, you know, clients going to events, Right? I'm always on the move, all right? And I understand that money is only gonna flow to me if I'm in the money energy, right? Yeah, I'm a stay-at-home mom, but also too, right? The money's not home, the money is when I go out, okay? I gotta be around the energy of people, even my customers, with, I'm training them on the products that they need for their body. Okay, money comes from people. The more money you want to make, the more people you have to help. God put us on this earth to help each other, right? But some type of exchange has to be met, right? You have to have some type of exchange in order for me to sit down with somebody and help them come up with a business plan and, and, and a life plan. They have to exchange something with me. Nothing's free. The Bible talks about this too. Right? Nothing is free. Right? Heaven is not golden just because. Right? It was made. Right? It was made. Right? You exchange with others, guys. And then you can be able to service people better. You can't service nobody if they don't have any money to give you. Okay? If no one has no money to give you, you cannot service them. Okay, that's why when I was a social worker, I hated the job because I wasn't making money and I couldn't service the clients the right way because I was broke myself. See, when you broke and you have broke energy, it shows. When you're broke, you always thinking about broke. You always have broke thoughts. You have broke energy, right? You wake up thinking broke. You go to sleep thinking broke. Then everybody around you, you're attracted to everybody that's broke. Okay? Money comes from people. Money is an energy. And money doesn't flow to negative energy. Money doesn't flow to people who complain and whine. Right? Money flows to people who can make it, get it, make it, keep it, and multiply it. Most people don't even know how to make money. They just know how to go work for it. You got to change your energy. You got to get a part of a business that has products or services that can help many, right? My goal for this year and next year 
is to get my affiliate companies working on autopilot so I can just be like a full-time coach, coaching people. People will exchange money with me to sit down, right? My goal is to have five clients a month at $3,000, right? Three times five is what, $15,000 in coaching people a month. Then my affiliate stuff running me another five, 10,000. It's $25,000 a month, right? That is my goal, right? So energy, I'm gonna have great energy, okay? I'm gonna service, my goal is to service five people a month at $3,000, okay? And then have my affiliate companies running on autopilot. So that's like my starting goal. Right, so I know where I want to go. I know what my plan is. Now I just got to put it into action. Okay, I know what income I want. I know who I want to serve. Right, money comes from people. Money you have to exchange. So in order for me to sit down with you, do a consulting with you, some type of money energy has to be exchanged. If you're running a business for free and you're giving out all free advice, guys, you don't, you're not running a business. A business, money has to exchange. Now, they have nonprofits where you don't even have to have any money. You can just give out information for free. So that's not a business. That's a nonprofit. But if you try to run a business, something has to exchange so that you can provide the service. Okay? You can't go get your car serviced without paying, right? You can't go get your hair done without paying, okay? You can't get the maid to come to your house without paying. Exchange has to happen, okay? So all you people out here giving all this free advice, guys, I can guarantee you are not growing your business. Nothing is free. I don't, you know, people want to, people want me to look at their websites and people want me to look at their blogs and they want me to do this and do that. Okay, well, I charge $100 for 20 minutes. It's a service that I'm going to charge. And if you let people waste your time, guess what? They call clock suckers. And if you're not telling people to pay you for your time or don't spend time with people who don't want to pay you for it. Right? There's plenty other people out here, guys, believe me, in this world, on the internet, that'd be willing to pay you $3,000, $10,000 for your time, okay? Believe me. <laughs> I'm a living witness, okay? That people are willing to pay me for my time. Is everybody willing? No, I'm not, and I don't wanna work with everybody, right? And that's the lovely thing, too. I don't have to work with everybody, and I don't wanna work with everybody. But money is simply an energy. Once you get that good energy, you start to exchange, get rid of the broke friends, get rid of the negative friends, right? Start reading books like Expert Secrets. I'm gonna put the book below. Read books like uh, Think and Grow Rich. Think, read books like Wealth Choice. Think, read books like uh, The Magic of Thinking Big, Three Feet from Gold. Read books that's going to help you change your energy and change your thoughts about money. And you'll never be broken in a day in your life, guys. So comment below, guys. What did you learn about money? What did your mom, dad, cousins, aunts, you know, your adult figures in your life, you know, tell you about money? Leave your comments below. And, uh, you know, let's discuss, you know, how, what we were taught and, you know, what are we willing to do to now learn a new way or new information about money? Okay. This is your girl, successlevelcoaching.com.